Hello again, everybody. It's the Reverend Jay Goldstein, and welcome to another episode of Activities. And today's activity is going to be Shark Frenzy, the wind-up fishing game. And here it is, Shark Frenzy. Here are the sharks. Here's the fishing game that winds up. And for the frenzy, well, you're going to have to wait for that. Let's look at the packaging first, shall we? Here we have the backstory. Apparently this happy-go-lucky shark has been terrorizing a small beach community and we have to stop it by fishing for it. Makes sense? Let's take a look at some of the uh, propaganda here. Uh, let's see. Hours of fun. Well, I promise this video will not be hours of fun. <laughs> Hopefully just mere minutes of bearableness. Uh, great for travel. Possibly it's magnetic. Magnetic games are great for travel. Uh, perfect party favor. I don't know. The word perfect is thrown around so often these days. I don't know. Um, test your fishing skills. Yeah, really, I don't think that uh, this is going to in any way uh, test my ability to catch and <laughs> catch my dinner. And let's see. Um, Oh, one to three players, which is great because I qualify for one to three players, and uh, here are the rules. Catch the most sharks and win the game. Well, if I'm playing alone, I guess I'm going to wind up winning. I will wind up catching the most sharks. Or I guess I can try to catch the most sharks before the game winds down and then try to beat that record. Here's the choking hazard. It's magnetic, so all kinds of scary bits about infections and death and woo, don't eat this, kids. Uh, a regular choking hazard also. And, oh, before we start, I just want to point out the entire game, the entire packaging is fish-shaped. How fun is that? We can play before we even get home. But uh, that's not what we're going to do. We're going to actually play this game right now. So let's open up the package and destroy its collectible value. And you'd think I'd be better at doing this by now, but for some reason these always are a little bit difficult to open up. Ah. Okay, so there we go. And let's see what pieces we have. We have some fishing rods, which... Uh, Okay, little fishing rods are like little sticks with little magnets uh, stuck on them. And this is the game board, which uh, has little sharks in it, little magnetic sharks, and they're in little uh, holes here, as you can see. And I'm guessing what happens, is I'll have to guess, I know what's going to happen is I'm going to wind this up. And these are going to go around and probably make a whole lot of noise. And I'm going to try to fish them out with one of these rods. I'm going to take the dark blue rod. Now let's see if I can't... Oh my goodness. Here's a problem. It's all like wrapped up here in some sort of overly clever way. Uh, is that a piece of tape on it? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just a piece of tape. I thought that was... Uh, wrapped up string or something. I was going to have to consult the Boy Scouts manual to get this thing freed up. <sighs> okay. So this is the, uh, this is your fishing pole. And these are your sharks. So all I have to do now is uh, wind this up and try to go fishing. Now my understanding is it's not just catching the most fish here, but you want to catch the fish Oh, the sharks, excuse me. The sharks that match the color of your rod. So after I wind this up, I am going to actually simply attempt to get one or both of the, uh, the dark blue sharks. But if I can catch any of them, I will be happy. So let's go. It's time for Shark Frenzy. Oh, and it's quite a frenzy. Look at that. It's, come on, seriously? One. Come on, let's get it. And two, come on. Oh, can I, before, oh, the frenzy is over. Wait, 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 start it again. It's come back to life and, and that's it. It's, that's it. So that's it, that's shark frenzy. Uh, apparently it just goes around and if I get good at this, I should be able to get more and more of these out of it during the time that the winding runs down. But here it is. Here's one of the sharks. That's a shark that I caught. I'm going to name him Bruce. 
after the shark from Jaws. Oh, look, his, his little mouth moves and everything. I didn't even realize that. Let's see if we can uh, see if there's some action when you actually catch him there. Does he actually bite down on the magnet? No, not really. But that's kind of cool, and that's kind of a fun little game for a couple of bucks. Uh, it's Shark Frenzy. If you enjoyed this video, uh, hit the share button, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, um, hit your belly button. That's always fun. <laughs> anyway, uh, thanks for watching my video. It's the Reverend Jay Goldstein. Ta-da! This is a frustrating sport.